The Adamawa state government has challenged parents and community leaders to take the education of the awards very serious. Governor Omaru Fintiri gave the charge while flagging off the reconstruction and renovation of 165 classrooms in Fufuri and Guyuk local government areas of the state. Fintiri says the rehabilitation of the classroom, which is a collaboration of the state government and the United Nations International Children's Emergency Fund, UNICEF, will help address the educational challenges faced by the state, even as plans are on ground for the reopening of schools. We understand um, in the IDP area where you have um, situations where there are overcrowdedness, um, these children are vulnerable to COVID infection. So by doing this, we are trying to limit the social distances, the overcrowdedness over sanitary and loose areas, lavatory areas. So we feel that doing this um, by so supporting them with um, such uh, uh, pampers, we are in a way mitigating the spread of infection and reducing contacts among these young children, which are quite vulnerable. It is important to them. They will use it in their children. And also we are also giving the pregnant women, they use it after they have delivered their children. So they should use it wisely, use it. Be, uh, when they are using, they should wash their hands before using it and also wash their hands after using the pampas. We are really very happy. At least they have shown consign that these are some of the items that no man, no everyone can be able to produce. And, um, you know, some of the challenges we really face as mothers, as parents, so the money to be used for buying these pampas um, is not all that easy. So we really want to appreciate them for their kind heart. And we pray that the Lord will continue to bless them and um, grant them their heart desires.